how to make candles when the world is dead, the nights are colder than a tax collector's heart, and your flashlight died three weeks ago. The cities? Silent. The power grid? Just another ghost in the dark. Your only light is the occasional fire from something you accidentally kicked over. You need light, heat, and maybe a little psychological comfort before your brain starts talking to the walls. Solution? Candles. Ugly, desperate, beautiful candles. Start by raiding old restaurants, abandoned pantries, or your ex's hoarder closet for anything remotely waxy. Candles, crayons, half-melted birthday cake decor. Scrape the good stuff into a dented tin can. Heat it over any flame you trust not to explode. Now, find a wick, cotton string, shoelace, or the hem of your last clean shirt. Don't worry, you won't need it where you're going. Tie it to a stick, balance it over whatever jar, cup, or skull-shaped mug you've got. Pour the melted wax in slow, like you're performing a sacred ritual to the gods of flickering hope. Wax stores chemical energy. The wick turns that into heat and light by burning slowly instead of exploding like a propane tank in a bad movie. And when the world's dark, even the ugliest candle feels like fire stolen from Olympus.